Hello again, everyone. In this segment, we're going to talk about this, this absolutely beautiful example of artistry from Acoma Pueblo, west of Albuquerque, New Mexico. This piece dating 1890s to 1900, and there's some elements that are readily apparent. You, you can see better close-up examples looking on the website, clicking on, on the pictures that we have there. Uh, several items make this just an exceptional piece of, of pottery. First of all, if, if you were here to hold it, it's like a feather. This is an exceptional piece of pottery made by a master potter at Acoma. Lovely pie crust rim, four rich colors, and birds. So birds are, are, are very much in, in demand among collectors of Acoma pottery, very, very, mu very much loved. Uh, this piece may have been created for, for the art market. It's got a lot of patina that may have been from, from uh, use and handling by, by collectors. Uh, I don't see any sign of ethnographic use on, on the inside. It's possibly created for the art market. Uh, interesting elements, the, the orange, this is what the, the, the artist uh, uh, was hoping for. Um, se clear separation of the orange, the orange and the red. Beautiful, deep orange bird. Uh, but the natural outdoor firing process isn't always that, that forgiving. And as you rotate the jar to the other birds, you can see the orange is there, but fire clouds have kept the orange from, from emerging totally. So a lot of fire cloud element on this bird. Bird number two, a little more orange. Then an explosion of orange in this particular bird. Uh, that's part of the natural firing process, part of the history of, of this jar and the serendipity element uh, that makes historic Pueblo pottery so beautiful and, and, and interesting. Uh, the rest of, of the design elements, the birds are all fra framed in a uh, series of, of, of abstractions and lines, uh, possibly representing uh, clouds and, and rain as the designs often do in Pueblo pottery. Uh, but you can see just masterful use of lots of design elements and an absolute gem example of Acoma pottery from the turn of the century.